Hello everyone and welcome back to the Acumen channel. Today we're going to be reviewing the We Care Disposable Face Mask for Kids. These seem to be very popular on Amazon. They have a 4.7 out of 5 rating with over 7,000 reviews and they currently cost $15.98 for a 50 pack. So this is how the packaging looks. On the actual packaging, it also doesn't have any sorts of claims when it comes to the ASTM level or anything of that sort. They are individually wrapped and they have a variety of prints. So here's how it looks. Um, this mask actually has, do all of them have that? These masks have a hole right on the front of the mask. The quality of these are just very standard for a uh, disposable mask. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna grab another one. So I'm gonna grab this blue one. And this blue one also has those two little holes. The nose wire is very flimsy. Let's go ahead and try this on. So these are a slight these are slight smaller than your reg regular disposable face mask because they are a size small for kids. So this is how they look on. So let's go ahead and test these on a TSI machine. We're gonna be testing both the filtration percentage and the pressure drop. This is our TSI machine model 8130A, which is also the same filtration testing machine that NIOSH uses to approve N95 respirators. Our procedure is also inspired by NIOSH. We first run a tester setup and start removing the headband from the respirator before placing it onto the testing plate to ensure a proper seal. Then we make sure that the mask is properly and completely sealed with hot glue to the testing plate. When applying the hot melt glue, we make sure that there is no holes or leakage around the seal to ensure accurate results. The testing plate is then attached to the frame and the box is placed under the TSI filter holder for testing. The results are displayed on the TSI monitor. F stands for airflow rate, which we test at 85 liters per minute. R is for resistance, also referred to as pressure drop. This correlates with the breathability. So the lower the number, the more comfortable and breathable the mask is. E stands for filtration efficiency percentage. The first sample had a filtration percentage of 75.97% and a pressure drop of 15.1 millimeters of water. The second filtration percentage was 82.43 and a pressure drop of 9.3 millimeters of water. The last sample had a filtration percentage of 82.30 and a pressure drop of 8.9. So as you guys saw from the TSI results, unfortunately these kids face masks tested very low in terms of filtration efficiency, which is why we're not able to recommend these. And although they do have a lot of reviews and a pretty good rating on their Amazon listing, they have a very low filtration. So these are not really going to protect you or your children. We do encourage you to stay away from disposable face masks and just stick to your good old K95s or N95s that you know that will protect you and your kids. We've tested a lot of really good options and you can see all of our results in our website, acumet.com, and I'm gonna be leaving a link down below. So I really hope that you guys found this video helpful. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and also comment down below any kind of content that you would like to see on this YouTube channel and I'll see you guys in our next video.